Hey, Greensburg High School students in Mr. Pratt's class, it's just me, Paula Poundstone. Uh, I'm a stand-up comic. I have been on a radio show called Wait, Wait, Don't Tell Me on NPR since uh, hmm, a couple years before you guys were born. Um, I'm a writer and I'm a podcaster. I'm a podcaster because I'm a human being. And at this point in our lives, there's very few human beings who are not podcasters. It's like having skin. You simply have to do it. Um, okay, so here's a tip uh, that helps me in those jobs. But the truth is, it would be helpful in lots of jobs. Um, all right. I carry this cat everywhere I go. No, I'm kidding. Um, it's just that he won't get off my lap. I carry this pen clipped to my belt loop on my pants uh, almost all the time. I don't sleep with it because I don't wear pants with belt loops when I go to bed. Uh, I, um, I carry this notebook, which is oddly taken on the shape of part of my left buttock. But... Uh, thank you. But you don't, you can just use a folded up piece of paper. It doesn't matter. I have tons of pieces of paper uh, that were also folded in my back pocket. The point being, these two things go together. When I have an idea, I write it down. And uh, because I find that when I go to think of ideas, sometimes it's, it's just too much pressure. Whereas um, when I am just, functioning in life, you know, scrubbing the kitchen floor, sifting the litter boxes, I have nine cats, uh, uh, walking the dogs, doing the dishes, you get the idea when you're just doing the stuff that you have to do to get through. That's usually when ideas come to me. And, uh, and I, I jot them down, and then at another time where I can be more focused and disciplined, I develop those ideas in some way. Uh, or sometimes I'm just like, okay, what was I thinking? Um, yeah, and, and that way there, stuff doesn't get away from me. Um, yeah, so again, not just for those jobs, but really helpful for those jobs. I mean, there are days where I'm like, you know what? <laughs> I cannot think of one more thing. And then I go walk the dogs. I think that's when I'm most prolific, which is ironic because I really hate walking. Um, okay. And here's the other thing I wanted to tell you. And again, this applies to uh, any job you want to do. Uh, it's part of a poem from a 13th century Persian poet named Rumi. And I only heard of it because it was in a calendar that I had one time. But it struck me so that I uh, painted it onto my window in the front of my house. And it says, I don't know how well you can see it. Um, it says, be a lamp or a lifeboat or a ladder. Um, the idea being uh, that you do something for somebody else, that you be a leg up to somebody, uh, you show somebody the path, um, uh, or you just plain bring them on the boat. And uh, if you get up every day and do something for someone other than yourself, whether big or small, and I mean every day, then you are on the right path no matter what job you choose to do. All right, you guys, good luck getting through the pandemic. You will. I know you will. Um, you know, masks. Don't forget the six feet thing. That's very important. All right. Take care.